The global head of a minority Islamic sect has used an Australian visit to highlight persecution that his followers face in parts of Asia. Mirza Masrur Ahmad is the spiritual leader of the Ahmadiyya Muslims. While there's only about 5,000 in Australia, the sect claims tens of millions of followers worldwide. He's also used the trip to reiterate concerns that the violence and extremism in Syria could spread further. Here's Bill Bertels. Thousands of Ahmadiyya Muslims have been coming to this mosque in Western Sydney over the past few days to catch a glimpse of the man they believe to be the Muslim equivalent of the Pope. Mirza Masru Ahmad is known as the Caliph of Ahmadiyya. Born in Pakistan, he now presides as the global head of the Ahmadis from London. Visiting Sydney for a conference, he spoke to the ABC about his fears that the conflict in Syria could spread further. They have already ruined this, uh, the peace of their country, but they will just, they are going to doom their country. And moreover, this will spread to the region. He says Ahmadiyyas are taught to reject extremism, and followers have often been the victims. Ahmadis are a significant Muslim minority in Pakistan, where they've long faced persecution. A terror attack in 2010 killed more than 90 followers, and Mirza Masrud Ahmad says violence is continuing there. Every off and on, even every after one or two weeks, I receive the uh, news of uh, one or two Ahmadis being murdered or martyred. And he's also calling for greater attention towards the targeting of Ahmadis in Indonesia. Some time ago, uh, three of our uh, um, uh, Ahmadis were beaten to death in the mosque. The persecution reinforces this spiritual leader's determination to connect with followers of this small sect around the world. Next stop, New Zealand and then Japan. Bill Bertels, ABC News.